There are many comparison videos online between different blenders and most tend to be biased and not practical. An example of this is OmniBlend Australia's recent video comparison where they use an impractical lemon test to compare their product to the industry top brands, Optimum, Thermomix, Vitamix and Blendtec. Today I'm going to perform some quick unedited tests in our warehouse of some commonly used functions and that would apply to your blender. For a fair comparison, we'll use the 1.5 litre jug for both the Optimum 8200 and the OmniBlend 5. We will start with blending rice to a fine texture. We'll be using 300 grams of rice and blend for 35 seconds. The test is now complete and we will place it through a strainer. There is a great difference between the amount of remaining residual grains in the OmniBlend compared to the Optimum. The second test will involve blending one lemon cut in half and 800 mils of water. We will blend for a total of 35 seconds. The test is now complete and we'll place it through a strainer to see the difference. As you can see, there's a great deal of residue remaining and even a large piece of lemon in the Omni Blend. Whereas compared to the Optimum, there is a small amount of pulp and residue. During testing on another occasion, the Omni Blend did manage to blend the whole lemon, although there was double the amount of pulp. We hope you enjoyed these tests and thank you for watching.